last time on LOU. Valentina and Right Road, as well as El Miedo. Coming up next, we have our second Rise to Riches match. This match will take place at our first chapter finale. We'll have four different contention matchups. The top two competitors on that pool will then compete in the Rise to Riches ladder match. And we will see who will rise to Fortuna. That and what? The lights just shut off. Music? Who could this be? The high flying known only by the name of Bray Jordan. This man is perfect for LALU. Now, now, now. Que Nijo, que lucha libre universal was complete without the aerial assault rifle. And I've come here to make sure that LOU makes itself a household name. And as for everybody in the back, whoever I gotta deal with, you better bring your... Oh, no. For this man right here, it's none other than Diego Diaz. Uh, I'm sorry. Who's ready for the aerial assault rifle? I'm pretty sure that everyone is to I Amy. Mean, wanna bring this to the next level? Not at all. You can even pass Barry's level, or Oryx, or even Joshua's. So why don't you do us all a favor and just go away all together, Trey? With guys like you, there's always that one rookie that always likes to come out and try to stump somebody that works hard for his place. And since you asked me to do you a favor earlier, here, let me give you a community service assignment myself. And do us all a favor. And please, go back to that bargain bin at Goodwill. And come back to me when you can step up to the plate and back up those words and fight me like a man. The jacket has come off. Might have a fight break out here. Oh. Just how we knew it. All talk and no action from Diego Diaz. Our first opponent is Trey Jordans, but who's the second? Got the lights again. Scare of the dark. If this music calms me down, as we all know who this is. The crowd awaiting it. It's, it's him. Ladies and gentlemen. The man of the dark mask. Part of the Yaw Soy Lucha movement.
back at it again with the ribs. Negro now to the top. I think he's going to end it here. The swan time. We got a flying Negro on the loose. And here we go. Two, three, it's over. No one even noticed Diego was there. Negro having no idea, but seeing Trey's back turned. Sending him a message telling him, remind Diego Diaz who you are. We still got more Lucha to go. Whatever you think of Lucha Libre, one of the men that you think about, the one, El Miedo! The lights are out again. We gotta, we gotta pay that electricity bill. With this man coming out here. You got fog in the arena. Wait a second. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. Delante de la muerte. The angel of death. Two great colorful individuals. behind them. Never keep your eyes. Because this might happen. And you know Azrael loves to bring up pain. Targeting Azrael's arm now. Classic Lucha here. Hold versus hold. So far, these men have showcased so great lucha action. Reverse! It's so 
much force. A stop to end it all. No! Double knees not connecting. Seattle wants that my head. Many people win this way. He wins. Miedo has done it. You gotta admit, Miedo has surely proved his point and has impressed the many fans. Gets him one step closer to the hearts of Lucha Libre. Wait a second, what is he doing? What is he? Oh gosh! This isn't what Lucha Libre is about. Such disrespect. Israel, leave him alone. It's over, it's done. You lost. No, no. Someone, someone help. Oh gosh! Shocking abuse. Azrael. Another power. Oh gosh, on the ring post. I'm sure Azrael is happy now, but at what cost? Here we go now. Now we have security coming out. But what do you expect from the angel of death? Wait a minute, no. Azrael, no. He's had enough. Someone stop this man. Get security out here. This is not enough. El Miedo could be out. But what do you expect from the angel of death? 